Hey, what's up everybody? It's me, Mr. G, the art geek, once again, coming at you with another coffee painting slash mixed media painting slash fun art making process today. It's mostly freestyle and exploration, and I use dark instant coffee, just like I would use watercolors, and I think about value the same way I think about value when we do our drawings, and we go from dark to light. Look at this detail, and let's jump into it. All right, for this tutorial part, we just use a simple egg shape and we start with the dark coffee and we blend from dark to light. And like I said, think about it in the terms of drawing value, going from dark to light when we blend. You can use the dirty water that you've already used to clean the brush to get your mid to light tones. And that paper towel, of course, will help you lift up some of the coffee so you can get those light tones. Don't rub the paper towel, just really dab the paper towel down and it'll start picking up the stuff. Alright, for this next section, I'll find the edges where the tones change and I'll trace those edges. Some places I'll leave filled in, some places I'll leave open and just freestyle to make it what I want. Then I'll go back to the oval, I'll trace out some edges and I'll fill in one spot with darker coffee to give the appearance of a hole in the shape. For this section, I'll take a coffee stain maybe by using the bottom of a coffee cup that has coffee on it, and I'll turn it into a tube using a pencil and blending techniques. Next, I'll trace more edges and I'll fill it in with white acrylic paint for highlights. After that, I'll use another cup and make another coffee stain. Once that dries up, I'll work with it later. For the last step, I stain the background with light coffee and add spatter effects just to have a little fun. Keep your work loose and expressive. Hope you enjoyed this video.